Today on Logan Lee Adventures. After a long drive, the next couple days is all about exploring this new part of the Rainbow Nation that we've never been to before. Morning, guys, from South Africa. So that's right. We just crossed the border this morning. It took us uh, across the border from Mozambique. We left Maputo and then we crossed over to Nelsbrun in South Africa, which is where we are right now. So we are back in South Africa for the rest of our road trip. No more Lesotho, no more Swaziland, no more Mozambique. And now we are going to check into our lodge. This place is so beautiful. I feel like I've walked into kind of like a Pinterest mood board for like a very peppy, bright Easter place, which I love. To this lawn ahead of you, that view. So we are definitely gonna lounge here later on me and Yuru once we get our bags into our room. But look at this outdoor lounge here as well. Wow. And then it overlooks, as you can see, Nespru. Ooh. Wow. What? This is such a beautiful room. And we have all of this. So the AC just got turned on. Of course, gotta kick that up. It's still about 30 degrees outside. This is the washroom. Really nice and modern. Just the right space. Do you wanna do the bed test here? <laughs> you ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> sir? Yeah, it's so sturdy. Changed into our swimsuits and we're literally the only one at this lodge. So we have the whole place to ourselves. Yeah. <gasps> Shoot! Just jump. Whoa! Look at that. Right there. He's just jumping around our lodge. This is wild. There's another one right there. Right there. Look at him. I mean, that's why they have like that. Come, come. Come, come. Come, come. Who's <laughs> coming? For our first meal back in South Africa, we're at a restaurant called Droz. So Droz is kind of like a spur, which is a like a typical South African chain. And we're gonna order a few things up. Let's see what we get. We've got a strawberry milkshake and lime milkshake, but they're so sweet. It tastes like you're sipping cake, cake batter. <laughs> Hello? Mister? Mister? <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
Oh, now it's camera proof. Hello. <laughs> 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 Let's go. We have to wake up. Okay, okay. No, no, we have breakfast. We have breakfast. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> we shut the bed. Like this jerk. Morning, guys. So we have officially woken up. We're here in South Africa in Nelsbrood at our lodge and we are yeah. heading to breakfast. After breakfast views of Nelsbrood in South Africa. One of the things I love about this country is that no matter most cities that you are in, no matter where you look, there will always be mountains kind of cradling the city. Like all of these buildings are just backdropped with mountains. And then waking in them, waking up in them is, I mean, it's beautiful. So we are at Swadwala Caves. So Swadwala Caves is just outside of Nelspruit, South Africa, where we were staying last night. So we took this drive, this gorgeous drive through the mountains, and then we saw this sign for these caves, and we're like, what's that? Okay, why not? Let's check it out. And we drove down, and we drove in, and now we're here at this gorgeous site. And we're about to go on a little guided tour through these beautiful caves. Apparently they're beautiful, they're huge apparently, and they're supposed to be one of the oldest caves so this is the basic rock structure of this cave. And beside them, the three praying nuns. Ah. They are 40 million years still active and growing. <laughs> Can you see the things coming from the ceiling? Yeah. What do you think it is? Looks like ropes. <laughs> yeah. Or like trees, uh, roots. True. Ah. So those are roots of a wild fig tree growing on top of the mountain. Okay. They penetrated 11 meters of the mountain in wow. these caves. These caves were covered by water. You have to crawl through and launch down these caves. So cool. After those beautiful, beautiful Swala caves that we were just in with, just, just unspeakable. Like, that was my second cave I've ever been in South Africa, but it was definitely really worth it and just random because we didn't expect it on our trip. And now we're in Sabi, the town that we're gonna check into later tonight, but we're going to this place called Wimpy's. Yeah, like Diary of a Wimpy Kid. So Wimpy is a South African fast food chain, but it's like a breakfast fast food chain joint. And on Mondays, Wimpy's in South Africa has a deal where you get buy one, get one free. So you buy like this three year old all breakfast meal that includes everything and get a whole nother three, like whole nother meal for free. So it's crazy. So we're gonna go and order right now. This is Thank like, you. they call this the toffee chalk milkshake, peanut butter, yeah, peanut butter milkshake. Honestly, I know you guys are watching this and you see all the things that we drink and eat and how do we not gain, we've been gaining weight, we've definitely been gaining weight. Um, We'll work out later on, but is it worth it? We're in a relationship. It? Yeah, we're in a relationship. Like, it's okay. Once you're, yeah, once you're not single anymore, you can. I'm doing my hair. I'm joking. I love, I love going to the gym, but I love eating more. So, am I gonna turn down a uh, 600 calorie drink that could induce a heart attack three years down the road? No, because it should taste good. 
And we're sharing. Yeah, we're sharing. So it's like 300 calories each. Okay, so the buy one get one deal looks really basic, but for like spare change money, you can't, you can't beat this. Just checked in to Forest View Guest House. I guess this is why it's called Forest View. As you can see, this is Forest View on top of this big wide open balcony that is really really nice. And the sun is just setting right now, so it's this pinkish nice shade of gold right now. Blue sky, let's see if you can see that. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's South African sunset. Love that. So we are in a town called Sabi and just here for the night because tomorrow we have some cool drives that we're doing and I'm going to show you guys around. Like I said, balcony. Heading in here is this huge open type of loft. As you can see, this huge loft is ours and I mean I don't know what we're probably just going to lay in bed because we're just gonna crash and watch some TV, but we're cute. All right, everyone, Yurun and I gotta go planning for our upcoming Safari game drive, which we will be all about in the next video. Subscribe to our channel, give this video a like and comment below. See you in our next adventure.